Shows and parties got put on hold this year because of the pandemic, so the entertainment industry really had to pivot. Think fast. Well, a Valley hypnotist said he quadrupled his workload using hypnotism to help people cope with stress and anxiety. Here's our Kim Powell. Hypnotism can be used for fun and comedy, but it can also be used to help you relax and learn coping mechanisms to deal with the anxiety and stress that we're all feeling right about now. But is it magic or is it medicine? Turns out it's a little bit of both. But the individual's mind is a very powerful tool. Bob Faith and, has been know, putting can, people to sleep with a snap of his finger since the Vietnam War. It was a medic who had been shot in Vietnam and he was not handling it well, but it was 1969. He used hypnotherapy to help soldiers deal with post-traumatic stress, but eventually turned to the entertainment industry. But 2020 happened, and the entertainment industry took a dive. From traveling three times a month for shows to having all his bookings canceled, Bob had no choice but to go back to his roots. On stage, it's nice, it's, it's fun. But if I had to choose, I'd take therapy over entertainment. Yeah. That doesn't mean you shouldn't call me for entertainment, people. Bob says he's able to help people cope with anxiety and stress, but also... I'm going to show you what you can do for your migraine. The idea is to help them help themselves. The idea is to help them know what they can do and what their triggers are when they touch your eyes closed. But anybody can be hypnotized. If you've driven down a highway and missed your turn off, if you've gone to a movie and become happy or sad with the characters. So if you feel like your day-to-day -day life has you in a trance, perhaps hypnosis will get you out of the funk. Kim Powell for Arizona's Family.